Yes, Paulie. And my worst of the week, and this is kind of interesting. Here's the headline. All right. I was almost kicked out of a youth basketball game this weekend. Here's the backstory. I went to my seventh grade daughter's basketball game, and the refs, I think it would be fair to say, were not having the best game, and some of the parents were getting on them. I wasn't one of the parents who was getting on them. There was a group of moms. They're great, and they were kind of laying into the refs a little bit. I was a little closer in the stands. It was not a packed house, as you can imagine. And the ref turns and goes, enough out of you. He points right towards me. Ooh. And it's funny because I really wasn't, in all seriousness, wasn't saying anything. And I go, me? And he goes, yeah, you. And then the fans kept getting on him. He thought it was me. So he turns back around. He goes, enough, enough out of you. And he's walking towards me. I go, hey, I go, I'm not saying anything. You engaged me. You engaged me. He goes, one more word and you're gone. One more word and you're gone. And you know the moment where you're in your head saying, what do I do next? It felt like it took 10 minutes because I was like, I felt like I was being singled out when I really, truly wasn't heckling this ref. But I also was like, I don't want to get thrown out of my daughter's basketball game when she's across the court. And okay, but if you would have said, okay, do you get tossed because you say, okay? I was worried that even if I said one word, yeah. like, gotcha, boss. Or if you said, sorry, does he run you? I was even worried about that. My, in my head, I wanted to say, how about we both leave and make this all better? <laughs> That's what is going through my head. I said nothing and just bad a smile on him. For the next and then you could have argued that you didn't say just one word. Right. Like, I, I no, that wasn't one word. Dan, and, and the moms are getting on him some more, and he's running up and down the court, and he's not even watching the game. He's looking back at me, um, waiting for me to go. And I, I think I'm proud of myself for biting my lip, but also I felt like I was singled out unfairly.